Hey guys, welcome back to another Cape Stance video, and today I'm going to teach you guys how to do a wall run 180. The prerequisite that you do need for this is how to wall run. That should be in the top right corner at the end of this video. I suggest you check that out before attempting this because it builds off of that significantly. Signif significantly. That works. Cool. Let's get right into it. Okay. So, I'm not going to split this into any points this time because it's fairly easy and basic. If you know how to do a wall run, then you have most of the points to learn. The only difference with this is it's a wall run, but instead of grabbing on the top of the wall, you simply push on the side and do a 180. It sounds difficult, but it's actually pretty easy. So, again, like a wall run, it should take off coming in like this. But, instead of swinging your arms up and going from the top of the wall, you want to put them on the wall. Now, depending on whether you like twisting left or right, if you want to twist left, then you simply put your left leg on the wall. But I'll explain why later. So, once you feel out which way you like to spin, then you can spin that on the wall. As well as your arms on the wall and bounce back. Like this. Cool. Once you have that done, then left leg and go up. And so with your arms, but then you're also going to put your right leg on the wall. As you might have noticed, I naturally now turn to my left. That's a good thing. So, do it again with more power. Like that. Then you'll turn more and more. So, when you come with your left foot, hands on the wall, and then your right foot, you really want to push with the right foot. That's what it's turning you. So, you just want to now add more power to that right leg. You want to go left wall run, left, run up the wall, arms on the wall, and then right, pushing you off like that. But now you need to add more power to that right leg and so you're moving away from the wall like this. <laughs> yeah, and then from there, you have the basic 180. You can add more and more power, way too fast for the first, because as you can see in my last one, I actually was you back on, so don't add so much power that you can stuck on your back. So and from there, there are actually some cool variations you can do. So I get the one where you can like do it over a gap and then do a wall run 180 thing and then come back over the gap, which is really cool. Especially if it's not a height of it. Don't do this with a mask. Like it's not. And then another one is like wall run instead of like 180, it's like a 360. So you end up facing the wall again. Yeah, so there are other variations like that. I don't know all of them, but you can just go through the wall run variations and stuff and other some really cool ones. Check out the tutorial playlist and also the wall run video if you want to attend this video. Cool. I'll catch you guys in the next one.